to Same Right Fashion Academy YouTube channel for another interesting tutorial. So today's tutorial we'll be making this peplum, okay, on the thumbnail right here. And this peplum, I'm using my pattern to construct it. That is the skirt part of my pattern. This is my waistline. So since this uh, peplum is connected to the upper bodies, so it means I'll be using my waist or front length measurement. So my front length measurement is 17. So you can see where I placed my tape. And you are going to take your hip measurement. So here I'm working with hip 26. Okay. So if this is your hip measurement, then the length of your skirt is by choice. So what we need for this is your waist and your hip measurement so this is my hip measurement and on the hip measurement i'm going to take from the center front line i'm going to take my hip divide by four so hip divide by four i'm using 10 inches and waist divide by four i'm using nine inches or eight and a half inches so i'll just connect my hip to my uh, waist Okay, because I'm attaching this to the uh, upper bodies, not just on a skirt. That's why I have to start from my uh, half length, so it matches up accordingly. So for what I have here, like I said, what you have on the damper, it depends on the kind of skirt you are making. So if you are making a straight skirt, you take your hip down. If you are making a pencil skirt, you just go in by one and half and connect to make that part pencil okay so now the most important thing is to show you how to create that simple um a curve so this simple curve right now i'm going to start from the center front to create it so from the center front it's just very simple all you need to do is to go in this way and you see, I freehand it because it's not something I will say, let me use my um, my pattern ruler. Because the pattern ruler might not actually give you this. So I just place my uh, paper and trace it out. So I'm tracing it out all the way from uh, my waist to my hip. Okay, so I'm showing you how you are going to trace it out and how you are going to connect it back. So, I'll just go ahead this way and create that peplum, okay? So, this is the peplum which is attached to the to that body. So, I'll just take, a, take it off and cut. So you can actually see that it's very simple. So this is the pattern I'm going to use to cut this peplum. So when cutting this peplum, I'm going to cut two times or even four times. Two times for this is the lining and the fabric I'll use to turn. Then I'll have my peplum stay on it, as you can see. So there's going to be a peplum stay on it. And then you'll be making um making it have uh, that uh, firmness okay with your peplum stay so once that is done you just bring your skirt and sew on top of it this way and the side the back skirt will be holding this the upper will be holding this so at the end of the day you'll be having your exactly what we have on the tummy so it's actually a beautiful peplum and I think I like how it is there on the thumbnail. So this is how we come to the end of this tutorial. And I believe you learned a lot once again. So if you are new to this channel, please kindly subscribe. Turn on your notification bell to receive videos like this every day. Like this video, share to family and friends. Drop your comment on the comment section and your suggestions as well. Thank you.